Hello there guys, welcome back. And guess where we are? We are in London. And uh, we're just outside of uh, St Pancras. Well actually, technically, we're just outside of uh, King's Cross. But uh, King's Cross and uh, St Pancras are basically... They're two separate train stations, but they're basically the same. But uh, what are we doing here? Well, we're, we're doing the epic, uh, the epic uh, cross between St Pancras to Euston. Instead of getting the tube, we're gonna we're gonna walk there. And I thought, why not? Why not film the walk? And why not test out this uh, Canon G7X Mark II and uh, put it to its paces? You can't just have a camera and not use it. Uh, it's gonna be interesting to see if the audio actually works. That's one of the things I'm. Uh, I think it's probably going to be like all ruffled and noisy, I would expect. So uh, we'll see how that is. I haven't put a pop, pop testing, pop guard thing on it yet. So that'll be one of the things to do. It's going to be just to see what the quality is like. And uh, I also want to get some food, but uh, I don't know if I've got enough time before my connecting train. Let's. Uh... Could have checked the directions here. We're going the right way. No, <laughs> wrong way. Totally the wrong way. Wow, I really know. I really know London well. So, uh, what is there to see? Well, you've got uh, you've got the McDonald's somewhere over here. You've got Barclays Bank with the uh, camouflage on on top of it. Why not camo that bank? That's so uh, they could do the tax evasion in there without people noticing. Across the road here. Hopefully, you don't get run over. And uh, there's a Burger King somewhere around here. This is all I know. There's a Five Guys. There's a McDonald's down there. There's a Five Guys and a Burger King. There's the Burger King. But that's about as exciting as it gets. Let's keep uh, keep walking. We've got a Costa. Wow. Actually, to, to be fair, out of the stations, when it comes to... Uh, let's risk our life. When it comes to uh, food, uh, so there's lots of options. Oh, Garnier just got killed there. <laughs> That's the dangers of London. Just, just traffic death at every corner. I'm looking at my map here to make sure we're going the right way. We're probably not. Okay. <laughs> Nearly knocked someone over there. Sorry. There we go. We are going the right way. Okay, so I think. Uh, I think the uh, London, uh, there's a library down here. My knowledge of London is, is pathetic. Yes, we're going the right way. I don't need to keep checking my phone here. It's a shame we can't do uh, live streaming from the, uh, from the camera. That'd be pretty, that'd be pretty cool. Then I could, uh, we could walk through London and answer questions as we went. Maybe we can set that up. I'll have to look into that. It might be like an app for it. Let's have a let's have a little uh, gander around here. Is there anything interesting to see? Right, I'm going to put my phone away. Wow, this is riveting content, I have to say. Welcome to uh, there's the uh, front entrance to St Pancras, the old original entrance that literally nobody uses anymore. I don't even know if you can get into the station that way. Now as you walk in this direction towards Euston, what you find is, uh, what you find is it's just, it just turns into hotels. nice thing with London is it's uh, you know it's just quiet and pleasant and peaceful the kind of place <laughs> London's the kind of place that you can go to to relax and there it is there's the, there's the British Library guys if you wanted to uh, learn something there's some books in there so there's a good little uh, there's a little museum in there with the uh, uh, the Magna Carta's in there part of it I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know history. Not whilst I'm walking through London, I don't. So, uh, yeah, good little museum in there, if you, and it's free to go in. So if you're ever lost in London and you're like, oh, I'm by St Pancras, uh, 
or King's Cross and you're like, oh, I really, I really want something to do, but I don't know, I don't have any money and I want some warmth because it's bloody freezing. You can go in the uh, British Library, you can look at their little museum, which surprisingly contains books, and uh, there's a little cafe, cafe in there. There's loads of uh, pretentious people on laptops as well, pretending to do work, but they're not really. Here we go, we've got more food options. This is London, every London street. Pret-a-Manger, Pizza Express, and Barclays. We're well, not gonna get much to eat in Barclays. You're only gonna get crippling debt for dinner in Barclays. There we go, I think that's the, uh, the Shaw, we've got the Shaw Theatre. Man, I hope my camera works good, it probably isn't. I'm uh, new to this, uh, I mean this isn't really a vlog, this is just walking <laughs> whilst holding the camera, but I'm new to it. Some uh, nice houses down there. One bedroom, half metre apartment for £15 million, pounds. thank you. Actually it is pretty pricey around here, with it being central London, plus half a million train stations. Ambulance. The Rocket, got some pubs, authentic. Now apparently it's supposed to take uh, 16 minutes. It's supposed to take, let's get this on the, let's get on the face. It's supposed to take 16 minutes to go from uh, St Pancras to uh, Euston walking. But uh, I don't think it is, I, th I think it's more, I think it's more of a 10 minute walk. Google uh, Google Maps with its uh, timings for stuff seems to be based around uh, that, that you're, I, I don't know, that you, 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 you're hopping to places. Oh my God, guys, it's a shadow. This is sun. I can't believe it's actually sunny today. It does make a big difference. I mean, it's not exactly warm, but, but it's actually nice to have some sun. I think uh, Houston's right down here from what I remember. This does look familiar. Well, oh, I don't know, it all looks the same though. I remember this uh, church is in front of us to the left. Some London buses passing in front of us here. Not as good as the classic route master, but not bad. They've done an all right job on the uh, new London bus design. Oh God, taxi there. Okay, just slow down, says a woman with a the pram there. I will shield the pram with my body. I don't know why, I should just let her get run over. Oh dear. So why, why do we bother protecting children, guys? Oh. We've got to, uh, children are there to be exploited through, uh, through crippling debt. That's what I've learned through the 2000s. Oh, look at these banking jokes, guys. We're on fire. We might be on fire with the jokes, but uh, oh, here we go. We are, we are going towards the station there. I was going to say we're a bit lost, but we're not. The uh, station is uh, just in front of us. Now Euston, this is what's interesting. Well, it's not really that interesting, but I like to pretend it is. Um, King's Cross, beautiful, after it was done up. St Pancras, beautiful, after it was done up. Now, now feast your eyes on this, guys. Look at this fur, this is, this is, this is high quality architecture. More beautiful uh, London sounds there. It's the sound of the underground. We're not, because we're, we're actually above the ground. Look, look at this, guys. Oh, I'm excited. I'm, I'm visually, my eyes are watering for the visual spectacle that is Euston train station. Get ready. Hang on, the reveal. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's so beautiful. Not even a hint of sarcasm. I mean, he's not. Okay, it's pretty damn terrible, isn't it? It looks like something from an 80s science fiction film. It's not, it's not really brutalist. It's actually moderately modern, you know. Let's not get run over by another taxi. But, uh, uh, I mean, this is, this is actually the bus station that's in front of the train station. But uh, there's a lot of stuff here. You've got some pubs and some more Nando's. <laughs> I think there's a Nando's just in front of us. You know, you've got the usual, you've got the usual stuff here, but, oh man, the wind's gonna be coming through on the mark, isn't it? Sorry about it, guys. But, uh, oh God. This, I think this probably is possibly one of the worst looking stations in the entirety of London, Euston. Sorry for people that 
live and work here. There's quite a few people that work here. I know a couple of people that work here actually. A lot of uh, offices around here. Well, <laughs> central London, a lot of offices everywhere. But uh, uh, I feel I feel a bit like I'm in Middlesbrough when I go through Euston Station. It's, it gives me a bit of a homely vibe. Reminds me of the North East. Look at this. <laughs> Subtle. Cycle racks. At least there's a place to put your bikes so people know where to steal them from. That's nice. Convenient for robbers. The little square's not too bad at Euston. But uh, there you go, guys. Let me... Uh, I've got to go and get my train. So that is the walk from uh, King's Cross, St Pancras, to uh, Euston. Wow! What an adventure. But you're, glad, you're glad I took you on that. I will see you guys soon. We've got some uh, exciting uh, simulator stuff. That's why we're on the train. So... Uh, Catch you guys in a bit. Take care, subscribe and like and all that business. Goodbye.